بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم الحمد لله رب العالمین و السلام و السلام على سیدنا و نبینا ابلغاسم مصطفی محمد صلی الله علیه و آله و سلم اللهم كن لوليك الحجة ابن الحسن صلواتك عليه وعلى آبائه في هذه الساعة وفي كل الساعة وليا وحافظا وقائدا وناصرا ودليلا وعينا حتى تسكنه عرضك توعا وتمتعه فيها طويلا الله give the lot of message to the everybody regarding the patience sabr the patience is very important to have a life, to get a unity, to improve our positions and develop ourselves. Many message Allah give to us. Allah ma'as sabirin. Inna Allah ma'as sabirin. O wa bashir is sabirin. Many messages Allah give to the people if you all can get them patience in your life. One of factors of the Imam Hussein alayhi salam can be uh, in their life, in his life, is the patience, the uprising of the Ashura. It's going to the patience. The patience is very important to the other life. If he wants improve our life, we have to get the patience. Why? What is the meaning of the patience? That is to wait till everything is coming to us? Oh, no. That is stability or adjudance. Uh, uh, which one is correct? Stability or weight? Allah say in the Holy Quran that mean the stability. You have to you have to effort, you have to endurance to get the result to achieve your goal and aim in your life. Duration the Imam Musa uprising Imam Hussein he has a very difficult situation duration that times but he could to achieve his goal because of his tawakkul and stand in his way and patience and he has the stability and endurance to get the result to save our life to keep himself, his family and our family for futures and we can see after more than thousand years now the Imam Hussain his name now is alive and everybody when they listen the Imam Hussein's name they become sad regarding the Ashura. We want to talk regarding the patience or stability in our life because of the Allah give the lot of message to us and we have to think and we have to understand the philosophy of this sentence and these small verbs but deep and very knowledgeable and it's very important for us and with this we can come in true of the unity and make uh, communications and uh, to that gathering we can do many things and we can improve our activities in their society in our society for example you have a lot of issues and problem in your life but you have two way one way to leave that and remove the subjects of the problems and change to the other way or you can stand in your way and you fight that's to that problems and to solution that problem and you pass that and to become the to become as a uh, result and achieve to your goals these two way under you you can choose which ones the first one for those who are they are not have a power they are very weak and they cannot manage their life suddenly they want to change their self and their life because they cannot patient in their life they cannot stability in their life they cannot endurance their life they cannot wait for example coronavirus is coming sick is coming M financial problem is coming 
Economic problem is coming. Political problem is coming. War problem is coming. Oh, oh, many, many, many problem in this world is happening. But sometimes it's coming. Regarding the family, regarding the children, regarding the job, regarding everything. It's maybe sometimes it's coming. But we have two way. One way is the correct way and the right way and the other one is the wrong way. We have to choose that. Which one we can, with which way we can achieve to the our goals. It's really important. The first one, suddenly we will remove everything as we want to go out and we want to, we want to forget everything. For example, when everything is coming to the sick, we want to end our life. Or sometimes we want we, we become as disappointed and uh, we forget the hope and tawakkul and tawassul to Ahlul Bayt, to Allah and His Prophets Muhammad sallallahu We suddenly forget these are opportunities in our life and we want to change it. For example, this economic problem is coming. We want suddenly going out and we want to live our life. We want to leave that position, that situations. We have to patience. We have to stability. We have to endurance. We have to stand up and get the power and get the support of the, our friends, our family, our lectures, everybody. The unity can help you. The first way, those who are individually doing everything, they cannot manage their life. When it's problem is coming, they cannot patience in their life because they they can uh, they don't have the support of the each others because they live they have they are living individually they don't like come to the peoples they don't like to make a unity <coughs> if there's any problem is coming they cannot translate the patient in their life they want to remove everything they want to leave everything then those who are they can get the uh, Ahlubayt advices, Allah advices. They can become as a unity. They can uh, go into the best way and they can understand the patient in their life and they can establish in their life and they can achieve their goals. This were important. So Allah say وَنَبْلُوَكُمْ بِشَيْءٍ مِّنَ الْخَوْفِ وَالْجُوءِ وَالنَّقْسِ مِّنَ الْأَنْوَالِ وَالْأَنْفُسِ وَالثَّمَرَاتِ I'm giving the many exam in the law, in, the, in your life. I'm giving the many exam in the duration of your life when you are living in this world. Regarding the money, regarding the family, regarding the children, regarding your position. I'm doing everything for you. I want to check your capacity and your capability in your life. How much you are on my way? How much you are on the Ahlul Bayt way? How much you are on the Islamic way? How much you can make a unity in your life? Allah give a many exam in your life to check you, to check you, and check us. And we have to stand up. Our way, don't disappoint it. And we have to strongly doing best with stability and endurance it's very important to get a unity Allah saying to us I make an exam to you regarding the some things in your life because of you have to study you have to teach in my class you have to learn my advice you have to train yourself and you have to improve yourself how we can improve our life with the problems if everything is easily can get it how we can get the experience how we can improve our life it's very important and Allah give this message to us don't disappoint it sometimes it's complicated but it's easily and simple to solution your problems but you have to make a hope in your life and have a plan
and have a aims and get the supporters from everybody to doing best with patience and stability and endurance. It's very important. It is the one of important factors in Islam's to get to tell to tell us we have many opportunity, but we have to study to learn to doing best in our life. Or sometimes Rabbu Samawat wa la arz wa ma bainna huma fa abduhu wa stabil la ibadihim. The patience and the factors regarding the maxiat, some of some of sin, sin in our life, lie, jealousy, or something else, or unpleasant threats. Patience. We have to patience to not do some things wrong in our life. One of patient is that those who are Allah saying we have to patience and efforts to don't doing that. For example, I have to train in our behavior, in our minds to don't do, for example, to don't do the lie, to don't speak the lie, to don't get the jealousy in our life, to don't do in riba, to don't do in riba. To do to do in tohmat and some other unpleasant traits. These are also like a patience. These are important, and we will explain inshallah in future. Inshallah, with help of Allah, with support of Allah and His Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and Ahlul Bayt alayhi wasallam, we will improve our life, and inshallah we will make a unity among ourselves. And inshallah we will. Handing up the flag of the Ahlul Bayt, inshallah. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.